to see you again to my short video series more about the how and not so much about the why creating a chatbot following the tutorial create a crisis communication chatbot and connect it to news and COVID-19 data sources we did some tasks before we got an overview of the entire project we created the Watson assistant service as our chatbot we created the Watson discovery service for search and analytics engine for unstructured data we use as a resource and then we set up functions action to access different kinds of resources we will get with parameters from the functions so the more detailed view to that with a simplified dependency overview we have the watson assistant service we have the assistant itself you yeah, we imported we have the integration as you remember we have the skill and now we use the webhook webhook to integrate the rest endpoint from functions okay so let us start with the watson assistant open up the Watson assistant service no oh, we can access this is our assistant our dialog so and here we have the webhook you can see here the mechanism to call external programs yeah to get data and now we will insert our concrete action we created inside cloud functions you remember and we enabled web actions as you can see here so now we copy and paste the URL for our endpoint so <clears throat> and now we can try it out uh, we can verify here that we have a um, folder inside this folder So in this folder, we have a dialog, and you can see with the dialog, um, if the question is about cases, see the type, the API, and then in the next step, we see the parameters, type and location is used, and here also the webhook is used and there is no parameter and if there is no parameter we know when it is uh, invoked by default we will get the information from the news we can try it out uh, what's insistent is doing because we did some short changes so I just uh, say news <coughs> and then you can see that is what we expect and how we ask for cases in the US. So and then okay get the cases in the US and now we can go back to um, the integrations and we can also open up Once again, the, in the creation, we have the chatbot already there. We have nothing to implement. We can test this. This is not for production for sure. And so we can also say hello. Hello. Okay. And I'll also get any news here. So, perfect. That's all. We set up the integration. I think that's a perfect sample for the 
very, very essential artificial intelligence services to make your application also attractive and it is useful in this case for sure. You have a good way to interact with your users when you use a chatbot and with the discovery service you can also create your own data resources to inspect it and structure, yeah, throw it in this um, collection and search mm -hmm. for information. That's cool. So this is a good starting point. I would say really try it out by yourself. I like it much. And go into the description below, check out the links, get your hands dirty. If you have questions, everyone which is available here, I guess is um, welcome if you have questions. Yeah, maybe we see us, have fun and bye.